the Samoan Bulldozer. A truly ruthless competitor. The following contest is a tables match. Making his way to the ring from the Isle of Samoa. Weighing in at 350 pounds, Umaga. We may be about to see a fight or a one-sided mauling. Umaga went undefeated in WWE for over a half a year. Yeah, during that time, Umaga earned victories over the likes of Kane, John Cena, Shawn Michaels, and Triple H. Unmatched savagery inside the ring from bell to bell from Umaga. I don't think there's anyone that is quite as intimidating as Umaga is. I've got to agree with you, Cole. Umaga has provided absolutely unmatched brutality in WWE. And his opponent from Denton, Texas, weighing in at 285 pounds, T-X Tornado. This is a competitor who isn't happy with the win unless they get a handshake from their opponent afterwards. A real respect for the business. Can they even work their hands properly? Apparently, they lack a spine. He said he'll steal the show here tonight, and he looks more than ready to deliver on that promise. It's anything goes, there's no rules. The only thing a superstar needs to do is to be the first to put their opponent through a table. There's a change in a competitor's demeanor when they have to prepare for this type of battle because it's complete pandemonium. No matter how you look at it, a tables match is the human skeletal system's worst nightmare. Really just laying it in. Just breaking. Oh no, now possibly setting up for a submission maneuver. Targeting the shoulder with the claw. This Escape and a takedown. Boom, right across the small of the back. Omaga oh, with a reversal. He steers clear of contact. Oh, what a knee lift. Over to check his nose. Strategy. Is there anything you can plan on in this type of matchup? Other than not letting yourself get put through a table? No, not really cool. This one is headed outside, guys. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. Sliding back into the action. Oh, check out this power. This is ridiculous. Dominance. Power for him. Now he's been put on the defensive. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Well, we know these superstars have everything at their disposal, considering... This match can end up anywhere in this arena. And now he's giving you all another chance to simply take it all in. Oh, what a wind-up. A rolling elbow. Oh, 
And we know these superstars have everything at their disposal, considering this match could end up anywhere in this arena. He'll take things into the ring. Taking this one back to the ring now. He set it up the table in the corner. This isn't going to be good. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Oh, that'll turn your skin red. Heads out of the ring. What's next? All right, back to it. Returning to the ring. Scoop slam. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. With all this in mind, take it from me. Nothing good ever comes from rearranging furniture. Down on the windpipe. Setting up the table, he's done playing around. Quick return to the ring. That unraveled on Umaga. Uh-oh, he's got him up! What a press slam! On a claw! There's the claw! This could be it! This won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. It's a roundabout strategy, but it might work. He let it go. Yeah, I wonder why. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a yard sale. This is going to be bad. This is going to be bad. Oh, oh, put through the table. What an ending to this table's match. Here is your winner, TX Tornado. Going through the table like that adds salt to the wound of losing. It's never fun to lose, but the added pain of going through a table is insult to injury. Hard to argue with another notch in the win column, especially one like that.